The import range function allows us to do wonderful things like importing different databases from other Google Sheets with a simple click. I'll use a Google Sheet that contains the different generations of Pokemon that I have already created to show you how this is set up. Simply write equals import range and within the brackets copy paste in the URL minus the edit part of the Google Sheet you want to import and then close this URL in quotation marks. Then select which sheet you want to import by writing its name and adding an exclamation mark at the end, followed by the cell range you want to import, and also enclose this part within quotation marks. Then you'll have to click allow access to link the two spreadsheets to each other. You can also make the function more dynamic so that the data which gets imported is determined by the entry to a separate cell, like I showed you in the beginning. Just replace the number in Pokemon Gen 1 with a cell value width and signs on both sides. This will add the cell value and then continue the rest of the function. You'll also have to make sure that the statements before and after this added cell value are within quotation marks. And then you can add a drop down select button by selecting the chosen cell, click insert and drop down. Here it's easy to add the relevant options that you want to occur within the cell and then pressing advanced option and choosing arrow. Now you have a super easy to use dynamic database thanks to the import range function. If you found this helpful, please give the video a like to help it spread to other people who need this info and in that way help both them and me with one simple click. Thank you.